Hey, not much. How you doing? Oh, no. what are they concerned about? They don't have one? I guess not. I was trying to call them to see what's going on. Huh? Well, just we're going for a bike ride. Okay. Where are you headed to? That way. Well, where's that to, though? I mean, just that way. Okay. Yeah. Where are you coming from? Been driving for a while? That way. I don't answer those kinds of questions. Okay. I'm just out for a bike ride, man. Welcome back to We The People University. My name is Abaya Israel, former police officer, former sheriff deputy. no longer allow your rights to be violated. Now, the Council Tyranny app is here by We The People University. This app is for everyone, those who want to learn their rights, protect their rights, or even those who want to go out and conduct First Amendment audits. Get the Council Tyranny app. This app has everything from major Supreme Court rulings, gun laws in all 50 states, stop and identify statues in each state, poster sevens, built-in pocket guides so that your rights are never violated, case law on search and seizures. It even has a link so you may obtain attorney services. Make sure you download the app today, available on Apple and Android. Cancel Tyranny, the app. Today's video is brought to you by a YouTube channel by the name of CJ Grisham. If you have not subscribed to his channel, please make sure you show support and go and do so. As much as we trained on defensive tactics and shooting in the academy, you would think that no one would know more about gun laws than a cop. But that's just not true. What we were taught is be suspicious, and if you see a gun, if anyone's open carrying, keep your eyes on that individual, even if it's a lawful open carry. If that state has open carry, it doesn't matter. This guy still may be up to no good. It's sad to know that exercising your rights could possibly get you detained or even arrested. So you must always know your rights, just in case you bump into an officer who does not know the law, that you wouldn't know how to handle the situation. And that's what we're about to witness right now. This guy knew the law, he knew how to handle the situation, and he handled it perfectly. I'm not going to say too much right now. Let's jump into this video and watch an epic ID refusal. Out here in Cameron, Texas, doing an armed bike ride. Got AR-15 on my back, made here in Cameron, Texas. It's a blackjack firearms AR-15 from Cameron, Texas. So, hey, let me turn my music off here. Hey, not much. How you doing? Oh, no. What are they concerned about? They don't have one? I guess not. I was trying to call them to see what's going on. Huh? Well, just we're going for a bike ride. Okay. Where are you headed to? That way. Well, where's that to, though? I mean, just that way. Okay. Yeah. Where are you coming from? Been driving for a while? That way. I don't answer those kinds of questions. Okay. I'm just out for a bike ride, man. Okay. Well, I mean, we're just concerned, you know, and anybody, you know, just to make sure everything's all right, you know? Yeah, yeah, everything's fine. Okay. Yeah, just out uh, exercising my rights, exercising my body. Okay. All right, just one minute, okay? All right. Wait, what, am I being detained? Because I want to keep my ride going. Right, just hold on really quick. Like I said, I'm going to get you back on the road. Well, I mean, if I'm not being detained, I'm just, I just well, want to yeah, go. We want to make sure that, you know, everything's okay. You know, do you have an ID or anything? Yeah, but I'm not going to provide it. I, I just want to go and uh, okay, finish my bike ride. Minute. All right, just one minute. Am I being detained? Yes, sir. Okay, for what so crime? We want to make sure that, you know, there's nothing going on with the rifle. Well, it's on my back, but but what crime am I being detained for? Because you have to have articulable suspicion. So, well, like I said, you being called on the rifle. I just want to make sure everything's okay. And hey, that guy's driving a truck. Do you have to pull him over to make sure he can legally drive that truck? Not only is Texas an open carry state, now there's no permit required. Texas. As of September 1st, 2021, permitless, concealed, and open carry is legal for anyone at least 21 years old who is not prohibited from lawfully possessing a handgun under federal law or Texas state law. However, there are some restrictions. You can either look up the open carry laws in Texas or you can reference your Council Tyranny app. Hey, if, I'm, if you don't have a crime that I'm suspected of committing, I'm going to be about my way. Okay. Everything's okay. You made sure. I'm good to go. I'm out here riding my bike. I got a bright yellow shirt on. I understand. So. Well, like I said, that's why we know. How do I know that the gun's not stolen or something? Well, how do you know? I, I, how I'm do I know you didn't just rape somebody? Well, you don't know that. Exactly. Okay. Well, <laughs> but I'm not going to bend you over and check you for semen samples, well, am I? All right. Well, I appreciate I appreciate that. You had to answer your call. You saw that there's no illegal conduct going on, right? Well, that's what I'm saying. No, no. Do you see illegal conduct well, going on? Sure. Do you, you have to, 
to detain me, you have to be sure or have some articulable, reasonable suspicion. But it's legal, right? Having a rifle is legal, right? Yeah, you can have a rifle. Okay, riding a bike is legal, right? Yeah, sir. I'm riding my bike on the right side of the road, right? Like this. If you just hold on. I don't want to hold on. I want to finish my exercise. Okay, so if I'm not being detained, because here's the thing. I don't think I'm being legally detained, so I have a right to leave. Okay, I'll tell you what. I'm going to keep riding down this way because I'm legally doing so. And your supervisor, if he thinks I'm doing something wrong, and he's got articulable, reasonable suspicion that I'm committing a crime, I don't want to hold on. I'm going to go about my lawful business. It'll take maybe two minutes. It'll, it, in two minutes, you can pull me over. I'm going straight down this road. I'm not turning off anywhere. I don't want to hold on. What? How are you going to find out if I'm supposed to have a rifle or not? But how is how do you know anything? It's none of your business. Do you suspect me of being a felon in possession of a rifle? Then you can't just stop people. You understand how Terry works. You do understand how Terry works, right? Okay, I'm going to go. I'm going to go because I'm going to exercise my right to end this consensual encounter. I will be going straight down this road. Thank you. And I'm on my way. Didn't even ask for permission. I may just keep this on. That was uh, Vargas with, it looked like Milam County Sheriff's. I can't tell, but I'm gonna keep this on just in case. Uh, if it does cut out and they pull me over again, Maybe I should watch where I'm going, huh? Uh, if it does cut out and uh, I've got other video going, I've got three different cameras right now that are going. So we'll see how this goes. I, don't I asked him, is it legal for me to carry this rifle? He said, yes. Is it legal for me to ride my bike? He said, yes. Am I riding my bike on the right side of the road? He said yes. So, uh, I'm doing everything legally. Here's another police car right here. Here's my question. Why are people calling the cops anyway? Oh my gosh, there's a guy, he's walking down the road, he's got a rifle on his back and he's riding his bike. The link to the full video is down below. Make sure you go over and subscribe to the YouTube channel, CJ Grisham. This guy did an awesome job standing on his rights. And the only way you can stand on your rights is to know your rights. So therefore, if you do not know your rights, make sure you learn your rights. And you can learn your rights by downloading the Cancel Tyranny app. Make sure you know your rights. With that being said, we the People University, signing off.